Hey church family, Pastor Charles and myself have been to Cape for hospital visits. In fact, say hey Pastor Charles. Hey. Uh, he's driving. I'm going to do the video. And uh, just a few things. I'm really excited. We had a great weekend at Terranova Church. We celebrated baptism, um, had nearly 90 in our Saturday service. Also had a good uh, number of folks uh, yesterday morning. And so also want to remind you, we're going to extend baptism. Um, we have at least one already scheduled for Saturday evening. Um, by the end of tonight, I would venture to say we'll have a few more to add to that. And so, um, again, just an opportunity next weekend to celebrate, to rejoice with the life change that's happening in the lives of people. And so you don't want to miss that. Also, I want to remind you to go ahead and mark your calendars for June the 8th, 9th, and 10th. June 8th, 9th, and 10th. That is going to be our Camp 48. And um, we'll be giving you more details, but right now you just want to go ahead and block those dates out. It's going to be a camp for our children, but also want to encourage parents. If you are available, if you want to invest maybe uh, uh, two days of your vacation or maybe you're, you've got some summer time off, um, those will be two days um, on that Monday and Tuesday, the 9th and the 10th, that you'll want to participate in. And um, so anyway, this weekend we talked about going. And the reality is we have the going down. We go to lots of different places throughout the week. We go to work, we go to school, we go to restaurants. And so in your small group, maybe again, remind one another those places that you go. And then I want you to go a step further. I want you to begin to discuss and have conversation around what would it look like if you were to put on display the characteristics of an authentic Christ follower in those places that you go. Um, maybe what are some creative ways that you can do a better job of being more um, ready to, to display Christ wherever it is you go this week. You see, I covered this weekend that we all have doubts. Um, the disciples had doubts. We've got doubts. We think other people are called and qualified and we're not. But I promise, I assure you, God never desired for you to go into your own authority or under your own power. He wants you to go under His authority. And so talk about that tonight. What might that look like if you, as you go, you went under His authority and you really trusted the fact that He was with you always. I'm excited about Know, Grow, and Go. This coming weekend, we're going to put it all together and see what it really looks like in the life of our church. Hey, hope you have a great evening. I love you. We'll see you in worship this weekend.